there's this one part of my trip every morning where I get this crazy static on the radio. It's right as I cross over the mountains. And it just so happens that every day, this point where I get all that, uh, all that static is when it's playing my favorite song that will be played on the radio, you know, now. I can't stand the static, but I love the song. It's so dirty and wrong. That's right, Pillow Talk is my favorite song that's out right now. There goes that static I was talking about again. I was really, really excited for that song, and then I realized I'm coming up on the mountain now, and there's literally no chance that I was gonna get to listen to that song. I mean, my goodness. Like, immediately after I clear the mountain, though, I'll get reception back. So, really, I'm only gonna miss, like, the first verse and the first chorus. I know I didn't film anything while I was in there today. Reason being is, I, I talked with my uncle yesterday, I said, hey, are we, uh, are we going in tomorrow? He said, no. I said, okay, this is like 5.05. So within the next 10 minutes, I went ahead and scheduled a meeting for my business. And then about five minutes later, I get a text back from him says, never mind, we're, we're working tomorrow, I'll see you at 8.30. And I said, no. I said, I got a meeting at 8.30. You know, I can't be there. So anyway, so I didn't get to be there until 9.30 or 10 o'clock. So we had to stay a little bit late, and I was trying to get stuff done because this drive home is just treacherous. But we'll be home soon, have no fear. Darn it! You may or may not believe what I just did. I'll give you three seconds. Okay, I made myself a smoothie. The problem with that is that I don't have any, well I don't have any flexi straws. I've got like regular straws, so I guess that'll have to do. But. Damn it, I knew this was gonna happen. I'm going to get straws sometime. All right, all right. Let's give this another go. Please let there be somebody up at the friggin' course, man. Bingo. We're at aisle 13, and there hasn't been anything on any shelf so far. It's really tempting to just grab a whole box of those. Let me share with you what just happened. I went to the store, it's shutting down, 50% off. And I bought a few things and spent $30. I spent $30 at a store that's going out of business having a 50% off sale and still pay too much. I literally would have saved money going to their competitor. No wonder they're going out of business. I know what's coming by the way. Publix, but I'm probably gonna keep that to myself. All right Not a good sign because it's 1020. I just got a shower um, Oh, I didn't tell you when I was in the store. I also got these things I'm gonna do a little bit of comparison because you know, I love peanut butter So let's see how you know butter fingers and Snickers, you know do with the peanut butters Anyway, that's gonna do it today was a pretty long day. Well, that's gonna do it for this I've still got a long way to go though.